Okay, so here's this quick exercise to find the the angle of the of the string versus fingers. So we really want to aim for a T shape, which is fingers finger angle perpendicular to the bow hair angle. The bow hairs are like our flat plane, our ground, and that's going to be the plane of each string too, where you're not touching a, a different string. Right, you have to be very uh, very precise with the angle of your bow hair. And your finger is going to be a perpendicular angle to that ground. So just fit, find it with each finger in a finger hopping exercise. So that's really simply it, just going across your whole fingerboard with each finger, moving and rotating as you go. Now one important part, you don't need your finger to be completely straight up and down, right? There's a little bit of a tilt to some of your fingers. They're, they're not completely even, especially fourth finger, but the, the, the angle that they come down is that vertical angle. So your, your hand has to rotate a little bit to get a really clean uh, connection. But that'll really help get slurs also. Because your left hand can rotate to get ready to play the string. And if your hands are trained so that they can move together, then you'll have a really easy time letting your bow follow your fingers. So I hope that helps.